Dark Web, explained in five minutes. Welcome back to the Knowledge Academy's YouTube channel. Today, we are going to discuss something a bit mysterious, the Dark Web. Stick with us for the next five minutes, and we'll break it down in the simplest way possible. The dark web has grown by over 300 percentage since 2017, making it a rapidly expanding part of the digital world as we know it. Dark web basics. What is dark web? So, let's start by knowing what exactly is the dark web. Well, it's a hidden part of the internet that isn't indexed by traditional search engines. Unlike the surface web, where most of us spend our online time, the dark web requires special software to access often the most common being Tor. Let me give you an example so you can understand it perfectly. So, think of the internet like an iceberg. The tip is what we use every day, Google, Facebook, you know the drill. But there's a hidden part called the dark web. It's like a secret club and you need special tools to get in. An estimated 50,000 hidden services exist on the dark web, accessible only through specialized tools. These tools keep what you're doing private, how does it work? Now, how does dark web work? Websites on the dark web utilize encryption and anonymizing tools to keep both users and content hidden. While this feature is attractive to those seeking privacy, it has unfortunately also become a haven for illegal activities. To illustrate, consider the difference between regular internet usage and the dark web as sending a postcard versus a sealed envelope. The conventional internet is like a postcard easily readable by anyone along the way. Conversely, the dark web is comparable to sending a letter in a sealed envelope, ensuring your message remains private and secure. This strategic concealment adds a layer of security. It's like employing a unique and private code. While this confidentiality serves well for safeguarding information, it also regrettably invites individuals with less than savory intentions. The dark web can be likened to an exclusive private club, offering secrecy and exclusivity, but not always attracting the most reputable members. Purpose of the dark web? Why people use it? The dark web is like a double-sided coin, showing two different faces. One side has a shady reputation because it's known for illegal stuff, selling drugs, hacking tools, stolen data, and even hiring hitmen. It's important to know though, not everything on the dark web is bad, but its secret nature attracts some not so great people. Now, the flip side is more positive. Some individuals use the dark web for good reasons, like whistleblowers and activists. These are the individuals trying to make a positive change in tough places. They rely on the dark web's hidden corners to stay safe while revealing important information. So, it's like the dark web has this mix of both bad and good, making it a complex and kind of mysterious digital world with two different faces. If you ever find yourself curious about the dark web, it's essential to exercise caution. Visiting the dark web can expose you to potential risks, including malware, scams, and even legal consequences. Always prioritize your online safety and be aware of the potential dangers. And there you have it, a brief overview of the dark web in just five minutes. It's a complex and controversial part of the internet with both legitimate and illicit uses. If you enjoyed this video, hit the like button and subscribe to our channel for more exciting and informative content. Don't forget to turn on notifications so you never miss an update.